Patarakal is a World Heritage Site. Aiholi, Patarakal and Badami are famous for their architecture. Aiholi was the school of architecture. Badami was the place that it was practiced at and Patarakal, the ground of coronation, became the place that this beautiful architecture was perfected in. I'm here in Patarakal, right between Badami and Aihole. Now, Patarakal basically means a platform or a stone for coronation, and that's exactly what this entire complex is about. On the banks of the sacred river Malaprabha, this complex houses nine Shiva temples, all to commemorate and coronate the kings of the Chalukyan Empire. It's absolutely lovely when you look at all these temples. What I like most about this place is the fact that you get to see both styles of architecture, the Aryan as well as the Dravidian. And in fact, in one temple, the Malikarjan temple, both styles come together to truly create a semblance of superb architecture. It's such an incredible sight. All temples facing east in dedication of Lord Shiva to announce the king of the Chalukyan Empire. This is the Virupaksha temple and it's not just the most important temple in Patarakal but it's also probably one of the most important temples through the period of Chalukyan architecture. This temple was built in the 8th century by the wife of Vikramaditya, Loka Mahadevi. It was built in commemoration of Vikramaditya's victory against the Kanchipuras. And what an absolutely beautiful temple it is. It's supposed to be architecturally perfect in terms of technicality. It has everything a temple is supposed to have. And this here, the platform where the Nandi is placed facing the Linga, is incredible. It's almost like the Nandi will come alive. It's such a beautiful idol. And right behind the Nandi platform is the main entrance, which faces the holy river of Mahaprabha. And when you just look around this temple, you know, there are carvings everywhere. There are idols, 32 idols of the gods that surround this temple. Every possible image of Shiva, images from the Mahabharata, images from the Ramayana, images that depict the life that was prevalent in that time with the kings, with the common people. It truly depicts the life through the Chalukyan period. Like I told you earlier, Patarakal is considered a holy spot, probably because of the river Mahaprabha, which like the Ganges flows from the south to the north. Up to 90 kings have been coronated here. And in fact, there's an inscription in one of the temples that supports this. 90 kings belonging not just to the Chalukya dynasty, but also kings from the Nanda dynasty, the Mauryas, the Guptas, Shagara, Purva, North Indian kings, all these. They have come here to have their coronation ceremony. I guess this place truly is sacred and well also has a majestic power about it. Mm. 